my goodness, you guys, it's snowing. What in the world is going on? It's freaking snowing. There's my dog trying to figure out what's going on. <laughs> Holy shit, so here's in the front of my house. Wow. It is snowing. It's snowing. Yep, it's snowing outside. It's the first time snowing in Washington State. So it's a little exciting for me, okay? But today we are here with all my highlighters and I'm ready to do some declutters. Um, I, I mean, I, I think I'm ready. I'm, I'm not sure. Although I'm not a big highlighter person, I just kind of want to keep them for like, you know, I kind of just, I don't know. I, I don't know. So let's get through them and see what I can give up, what I'm not going to keep. Uh, so uh, please, if you're interested in that, keep on watching. Give this video a thumbs up. Alright, so first thing in here, I have this one from Beauty Bakery Milk and Honey Palette. Uh, I think I only... Have I used this one? I don't even know. Maybe once. I don't know. Um, but the thing is, I got this in a mystery box. And I, when I saw it, I was like, why? No, I don't need any more highlighters. But here we are. And I guess I'm just gonna keep this one because I just got it and I, I mean, I got it months ago, but I haven't played with it, so I'm gonna keep it. Although I don't know how much I'm gonna like it, but I'm gonna keep it. Alright, so I have this one from Jeffy Star that is in Gag Me. I only used this one, what, two, three times? If I even used, three, used it three times? I don't know, you guys. I don't like all the glitters on it, but... Damn, I, I don't think I'm ready to let this one go. Not not just yet. Not just yet. And look at all this crazy packaging for it. I'm not I'm not gonna let it go just yet. Here's a quick swatch of that. Jeffree Star gag me. That's just a lot of gl glitter and grittiness, but I'm not ready to let it go, so I'm not I'm gonna keep it. Alright, next in here. I do have a few more Jeffree Star in here um, that I think I'm ready to let it go. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna use this. This is way too green for me. This is in Money Honey. I don't think I'm gonna, I'm not gonna keep this. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep this away. Uh, let's see, let's see, this. Oh, this one. Yeah, this one is another one from Jeffree Star. This one is in so fucking gold i should i keep this one i don't think i'm going to yeah that one is too dark as well so mm, no oh well yes i i went in with my finger uh but let me see i mean it, out of all of them this one looks the nicest but Actually, I'm gonna keep this one. I'm gonna keep it, but I, I am gonna give this one away. Uh, another one that I'm gonna keep from Jeffree Star is this one, Purple Mint Frost. I got this one in a mystery box. This was only made for that mystery box, so I'm not gonna give this one away. I'm gonna keep it. Um, next in here, I have this. Uh, Wonder Beauty, Wonderness, Dust to Dawn, and I do love this one actually. I like that City Lights highlighter, so I'm gonna keep that one. And also, I love the um, the blushes in there, so I'm gonna keep that one. Uh, uh, the Hourglass one, I kind of like this one actually, so I'm gonna keep this one too. I know it's funny because I, I say I'm ready to give things up, but I don't. So, yeah. Um, this one I'm definitely gonna 
I'm not gonna keep it. This one is from Colourpop. It was from the beginning of uh, the year collection 2020. I do not like it. I don't like how it feels. I don't like how it spreads on the face. So I'm gonna let this one go. <sighs> okay. This one is from uh, Fenty Beauty and it's in purple. So it does not work for me. Let me clean it up a little bit. But yeah, this one does not work for me. Um, definitely better for lighter skin tones. I I don't like it. I put it on for like a few times. Every time I put it on, I I felt like it destroyed my makeup. So nope. It can go. It can go. Okay. The um. Ufra. I just don't like this that much. But I don't want to let them go. I only had them for like a few months or like eight months or so. Okay, so I'm gonna keep both of them for now. I have one in Rodeo Drive, and I think this one is in Star Island. They're both minis. Hopefully, you know, they're gonna be okay. I don't know. So I'm gonna keep those. This one is from Sugary Cosmetics. Oh, I only played once or twice with this. But I don't like it. It's just, yeah, no, I'm not gonna keep this one. Uh, let's see. This one, I got it in a Mystery Box from Hank and Harry. Too glittery for me. I'm not gonna keep it. Give that away. Uh, this one from Fenty Beauty, I'm not gonna keep this one either. This is crazy, okay? Let me, let me open it. Alright, so that's the one from Fenty Beauty. This is how it sparkles. It's beautiful, but I mean, this maybe as a as a topper, eye topper or something like that, but not for my face. I don't, I don't, need that. I don't know. Should I just? I'm gonna put it on a chopping block and just kind of see. I'm gonna try it a few times and see what I actually think of it. If I feel like I cannot wear it, then I'm just gonna give it away. Um, next thing here, this one I absolutely love. So this one I'm not gonna give it away. This is one of the only highlighters that I did use for quite a while. This is Hustle Baby. It's in Hustle Baby and this is how it looks like. Here's a swatch of it. It's a very, very, it's not as sparkly as these two. As you can see, it's a very soft and I do really enjoy it. So I'm going to keep that one. Okay, so these last four, I am actually going to keep. Um, I really have not played with these two at all. <laughs> And I just cannot believe it. I had this, the Jero Cosmetics one, I had it for like nine, ten months, nine or ten months, and I have not played with it. I just put it in my um, organizers for um, bronzers, highlighters, and stuff, and I never reached for it. So, and I do like it. I just swatch it right now. <laughs> Here's the the three swatches you can't see much because the lighting is not the greatest here but I like because it doesn't have a lot of shimmer into them and it's just like a little bit of a glow and that's what I usually like for my highlighters so I'm gonna keep this one this one is from the bomb and this is uh, Mary Lou uh, Manizer I guess so I'm gonna keep that one. I'm gonna keep this one from Dura Cosmetics, and this one is in Sophia. So I'm gonna keep this one. Also, I kind of used this one quite a while, I would have to say. And um, I do like this one. It's from Too Faced, and this is in You Light Up My Life. And then, of course, this one from uh, Hourglass. Definitely keeping it. Absolutely love this one, um, and especially when I want more of a natural look. Uh, and this is in Ambient Dim Light. And yeah, let me show you what, everything I'm keeping and what I am getting rid of. Alright, so I figure you might want to see how everything looks like. So here they are, all the highlighters that I'm actually keeping. 
I um, they're all kind of a little bit kind of the same the only thing that is kind of different is this one from Fenty Beauty and that one from uh, Jeffree Star but most of them are kind of the same of course I have these ones right here as well and uh, yeah these are the ones that I'm keeping I'll count and let you know how many there are all right so we have 14 that I'm keeping um, definitely need to put some in a project pan for next year. Um, either considering Jera Cosmetics or maybe, um, maybe the Fenty one or something has to go in there. I need to finish one or maybe even the men, uh, the one from the balm. I don't know, but there are 14 in here. And these are the ones that I'm letting them go. I have to say though, some of these, like for example, this palette, I only used it once. For example, the this from Jeffree Star, I never used it. The Hank and Henry one, never used it. The one from um, ColourPop, I did use it. The same with the Fenty, I did use those, but all the other ones I have not. Um, but I'm, I'm just glad to let them go. Um, they're definitely I'm not gonna play with them so there's no point of me keeping them so there we go this is the declutter video for highlighters let me know which one is your favorite highlighter I would really love to hear about that um, and uh, I will see you all in the next one thank you so much for watching bye bye